Lindsay on Gears. Uh, let's get into the world of motorsport on this Friday afternoon. Let's start off with the local action and that of course is Super Series action which takes place tomorrow at Swartkops. Of course today is all the uh, free practice rounds etc etc. Uh, if you're in the Gauteng area, do yourself uh, get down to Swartkops. We spoke to Greg Maloney yesterday. It's going to be a really really cool day and it looks as though the weather is going to be spectacular as well. In the world of Formula One, sure, I tell you, there's a lot going on at Red Bull with Helmut Marco and Nicky Lauda from Mercedes having a go at each other. And uh, Helmut Marco saying, I take the final decision at Red Bull. Wow. So it's basically telling Dietrich Matzeschitz, you've got nothing to do with this. I am the one that makes the decision. Uh, funnily enough, Helmut Marko is just an advisor, so where does that leave Christian Horner if he's the team boss? And Helmut Marko comes out and says, I am the one that makes the decisions. I wouldn't, wouldn't be too happy if I was uh, there at the moment. Mercedes-Benz are very prepared to give Robert Kubica a test um, in Formula One and would also like to see him in DTM. He did do a DTM test. He was offered a drive, decided no, he doesn't want to do it. So let's just hope that Kubica's hand is getting better quicker than um, than has been expected. I've always been very skeptical about this uh, incident with Robert Kubica, but you know, modern medical science is pretty damn cool as well. The latest cream of Red Bull's uh, junior drive program insists that he is ready for the jump up to Formula One. I'm talking about this very talented Portuguese driver, Antonio Felix da Costa. This is a guy to watch. Hopefully, maybe he'll be in um, Toro Rosso in 2013. 24, what year are we in? We're in 2013 now. 2014, okay. This weekend it is the Spanish Grand Prix for MotoGP. Well, it's all about Jorge Lorenzo, Danny Pedrosa and of course Marc Marquez, the three big Spaniards that will be battling it out this weekend. But there is Valentin Rossi. First three practice from this morning, Jorge Lorenzo, three one thousandths of a second. Faster than Danny Pedrosa, Valentino Rossa three tenths down, Cal Crutchlow four tenths down, Mark Marquez seven tenths down, Nicky Hayden in the Ducati one second off the pace, 24 riders there, uh, Michael Laverty was four seconds off the pace as well. There should be free practice too between now and three o'clock, uh, if there is of course we'll keep you updated as well. I'll also go and find out in the Moto3 how our young Brad Binder is doing and I'll keep you updated during the course of this afternoon. Dive. Intersection turn on gears with Sasha Martinengo. Weekdays from 12 to 2 p.m. Central African time.